can't. I feel like I should be able to, like, examine shit. No? Perfume? Is clues? Might better go over here as well. I Got a tough guy. Is this a joke, bald man? Think you can handle what's going on out there? <laughs> I'll give you a taste. Okay, first off, don't I'm not bald. I got a buzz cut, okay? Look, there's still hair. It's called a buzz cut. I'm about to rough you the fuck up, buddy. Me and Terry are. Boom! Oh, he did damage! Wait, is Terry gonna die? Wait, no, 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 wait. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Maybe I don't have to attack with Terry. Maybe he can give me hints. This is smart. Oh, I can cheer. I can cheer. Brad, that's it. Brad. Sugar Mountain is astounded by your stupidity. Is that my mana? That is. Fuck. Hell yeah, I heard his feelings. What? Fuck it, Terry. Attack. Thanks. Wait, what? She's already dead, so I can see her in hell. The fuck? I feel like Terry just popped off. I want to say he hit like 150. The fuck? They are dead. They are dead. They are dead. He's dead. You can go ahead and say that dude probably dead. You got a worn helmet. I used to play football. I was a collegiate athlete. True, true, true. They are dead. You suffered serious damage. Time is a great teacher. Sadly, it kills all its pupils. True, too real, dude. Wait, wow, that's- wait, what the fuck? <gasps> Bambi! Howdy, motherfucker! Oh, it's Zelta! What's up, dude? Our pa- our paths hath crossed yet again. Do you remember our time spent as we lads? I do, fondly. My heart just tumbles with joy thinking about it, like your head in a dryer. Normally you'd be dead and stripped of your wares by now, but I like you, Brad. Let's have some fun. I shall give you a choice. Your yellow-shirted friend's life, or all of your belongings. Ooh! Ooh! Ah, Terry! Ooh, Terry! Yay, buddy! I like it, Terry. I do. I like. I gotta go shop there. Save Terry. All my sh wait. I don't have anything though. Oh, I don't even have anything. I, I have a helmet. That's it, and some beef jerky and some perfume. 
choose wisely, what would you give us? Fucking take all my shit. Huh. How b b b b boring. All right, boys, strip him quickly. I hear tell that a female is on the loose. My loins ache for some excitement. Off we go! All of your stuff has been taken. Beta? Yeah, it's so beta, saving my friend's life. But what if he's already dead? But what if this isn't even Terry? Ugh, ugh. My head. Whoa! You look like hell! Are you okay, dude? What happened? Shut the fuck up, Terry. Uh, we got hit by a truck. With some old friends, everything's okay now. Damn, first my hamstring, now this. You're a bad omen. Shut up, Terry! I told you not to come! Well, it's all good, man. I don't mind. I like hanging out. Okay, Terry. I, bet I gotta go left. I bet I'm, I bet this is the wrong way. I, I'll go a little bit further than I'm turning around. Oh. Could have done about that either. Nice. That's really awesome. I'm really happy about that. I like this game because choices matter. I should be able to make this drop. You're fucking kidding. You're kidding. I'm assuming I have to get like a like a grapple. I can fucking see this taste. Friendly, friendly, be friendly, be friendly, be friendly. Seems like a storm is a brewing around here. You look tired. Are you hungry? You have an empty bottle. You can have some of me soup. Also, if you need rest, you can use my tent. The tent is bait. Remember when what Terry told us before? Terry told us, do not. If you rest, anything can happen. Wow! Holy heck! The world can be saved. Find her. All right, chill out. I'm not, I'm not reading all that. Come on now. I fucking missed the save, you stupid bitch, and I'm one shot. What a little F word. Terry has no way. Terry, how Terry knocked out? bar as well? My intestines are in disarray. How the fuck is Terry already knocked out? He hasn't done shit. Yeah, he better get no XP. I just barely missed that save point as well. Did that on purpose. Smart. Smart, man. I, I like that. I like that. He's full of holes. There's a gun around here. I kind of want it. So basically... The, the entire population is dead. Oh, if you rest, you get HP? Okay. The entire population is dead. This is the only girl left. So, they are trying to use her for reproduction purposes. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm probably gonna wake up fucked up. Base Josh played a video game. Drop, Cine, Ghetto, Not, Buddha, Free Taiwan. These are formed. Hey. Soon. Thank you, boys, for those subs and resubs. Actually, didn't go bad. Do I go up or go through one of these doors? Hold on. Let me see what's in the other one. Yike. Meeny, meeny, miny, mo. Where the fuck is this hoe? T1 got those lines. He has that flow. T1 alpha male. That's how it go. up ahead. She's in an old clubhouse. Those pretty boy pricks kicked me out. So now I'm gonna kick the pretty out of you, prick. Wait, what? Whoa, put the knife down, buddy! I'm friendly! Come on, man! Let's get K. 
Canary to do uh, verbally abuse him? I wish it actually told us his dialogue. Cosmic Brownie, by the way. <laughs> I guess. Unsinkable, like the Titanic. <laughs> Here's a hint. You suck, I rule. <laughs> oh, there's a bottle for the soup! How do I get up there? I can climb these? Skill. You guys see this? Any game I pick up, I'm, I'm a bet. I can't drop right here, actually. I can't. Shammy, your boy Dennis, Zip, thank you boys. Damn, bruh, this game is lit as fuck, boy, I like it. For some reason, these shitty games aren't, like, it, the devs don't care. Wait, there's a bottle. I do no damage to it. You learn tell your friends some of your favorite combat tips. Maybe I should run from this. I feel like I should run from this. I'm gonna run. Rats party started escape. You can't escape! Uh-oh. How does 
parry deal damage, but I don't. round. Huh? What can I do? I can't escape. Boom! Big hit! Boom! Boom! We crushed it! Good job, Terry! Wait, what's this? Hmm. Do we risk it? Like, that was the only one in here, or do we turn around? Well, let's, let's fucking turn around. Fuck it. I'm, I'm lit as fuck. Terry's out of mana. Get the fuck out. I gotta go. I don't got any health. I do no damage. Hey, Tyler. Wait, really? Terry. I have no mana, buddy. Can't escape either. I'm gonna say Terry's dead. Uh, I've actually in LA during TwitchCon, offering my favorite streams on the private executive tour of Warner Bros. Studio Live. Serious offer, can you email you with LinkedIn if interested? Love the stream, my man. I'm om I'm om I'm busy. Wait, did he do it? I'm busy every single day at TwitchCon completely. My schedule is booked every single day. That's why I say. And I'm working. Nice save point, actually. Do we go through here? Yeah, this is the one we've back. Back fuck up from. The Omega Outlaw, Omega Law. Uh, my ammo. What are these? What a secret stash. Ten magazines. Mother of God, duh. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Fuck. Why doesn't it just re give you health back? 
You use jerky to heal? Not to full, there's no way. Fucking keyboard's absolutely dicked. This game is a sequel to Lisa the Fist, by the way. You don't really have to play that game to get this one, but you are Lisa from the first game's brother? That sounds like a goddamn spoiler, dude. Let us rest. I sleep, huh? What happened? <laughs> you suffered a serious head injury. Your SP has decreased, your luck has decreased. Awesome, dude! Awesome! He's knocked out cold. Alright, good. Okay, good. Alright, thank god. Thank god we both got knocked the fuck out. Hopefully Terry did as, as well. I can TMT. Thank you, boys. Protocol. Saish. GTF. Thank you, boys. Go down or up? I feel like I've been here. I want that jerky, but I, this guy's faking it 100%. It's fake. Ooh. Ah, Jesse. Ah. I don't got a helmet. I died. I mean, I gave all my shit away because I saved. Shit, Terry. Horrible choice. I made one of the worst choices of my life. I fucked up. Yes. Ooh, my screen's moving slow. Oh, hello there. My name is Nern. I'm considered the greatest historian of our t Okay, buddy. Next. I've got a wealth of not. Okay. Details wait to hear. Boring! <laughs> Great! Get comfy, my boy! Wait, <laughs> Wait, what? I've many a tale to tell. Let's see. Wait, are you serious? They just debated me. Now, now what happens to them all? I guess maybe so she could put ice in the glass, but they can make it just healing. Look, it's not even worth me reading. That sneaky bitch. Anyway, I'll save that story for later. So I'm sitting on my porch drinking sweet lemonade. The glass course. Ho ho! But suddenly, a great strangeness was my body. Something was wrong. I've lived many years and I've never felt something like this before. Do you know what it was? Up. Yep. It was my rocking chair. That wooden son of a gun stopped rocking. I looked down and realized a little rock have had gotten caught beneath my chair. A rock under my rocking chair. <laughs> I said it was never been that I had a little bit too much excitement for one day. <laughs> I stood to my jammies, brushed my teeth, and said my prayer. I was climbing to bed, I had to lose my daughter. Why is this epic music playing behind? Like, this is some fucking awesome for, like, folklore going on. God rest his soul, brushing her hair in the bathroom. As I turned across the hall, my body was swelled with emotion. I can't bear to an attractive woman. Is it me? Come on. Back in town, I'm a tall guy. I work out 40 minutes a week. Is that not enough? Now, my neighbor at the time, Tom Forknight, was very short. His wife, Karen Forknight, yeah, who are those women? Well, she was more attractive than my wife. I'd say she was about a soft six, whereas my wife was a hard four. Ah, yikes. What's the deal? I thought women liked tall men. Why was Karen with them? Anyway, my horse of a wife, god damn. This dude either alpha or retarded. God rest her soul, brought it to bed next to me. She decided to leave the bedside light on so she could read her book. It was one of her romance novels again, give me a break. As if I don't already feel inadequate enough, not only do I have to compete with Tom, and I have to deal with these fictional hunks. Aye, aye, aye. At this point, I had already suppressed urges of an intimacy. Suppressed. I rolled over and tried to sleep. Her bedside light was only a minor annoyance. I was able to drift off. Over? Nope. And I woke up to a big flash of light. That's about it.
talk about the way you're walking away you don't want to leave? If you really want to hear another story, I'll tell you. What the <laughs> okay, music starts back up, I get it. Oh, sometimes in July, it was in July, my local grocery store seems sells really good eggs in July. I don't know why. Do chickens operate better in heat? Fireworks, maybe? I don't know. I don't want to get off topic. Point is, the eggs that summer were marvelous. Anyway, my wife and I got her to soul, went to a BBQ that night. It was held at a Dale Spooner, Spooner's house. Well, it's backyard. Connie Spooner doesn't want people in her home. I think she's just an uptight bitch. So at this BBQ, I see none other than, that's right, Tom Fortnite. Now, early in the day, my wife, God rest her soul, had made potato salad for the BBQ. Personally, I hate potato salad. I'm a mash, I'm a mash kind of fellow. <laughs> so I sat in the TV room, avoiding her, until the BBQ. Once we were at the party, I made sure to distance myself from my dumb potato bitch wife. God rest her soul, I just did <laughs> it. just didn't want annoyance to think I would associate. I didn't want anyone to think I would associate with someone that would bring potato salad. Anyway, I'm his above mediocre wife. <laughs> We're already there. And get this. They brought a fruit salad with whipped cream. Nerve of those fork nights. Needless to say, I gave my wife, God rest her soul, a couple of <laughs> these, these God rest her souls. A couple choice words about whipped cream. First potato salad. Son of a bitch! A real tongue lashing! Oh, it's over. God rest her soul. <laughs> I, I kind of want to talk to him again. Just to see, just to see if he, uh... Yeah, another story. I I I kind of like him. I climb up here. I feel like I missed something. Can I open this? Negative. Damn. So wait, that's all there was over here. Wow. All right. So that was. Wait. Maybe if I fall down right here. I could have just walked around. Fuck it. Wait, what's over here? Oh, I came from the right. Nope, can't go that way. I like that guy. I like him. <laughs> well, hello again! What is seeing you here! What? Are you following me or something? <laughs> anyway, I often wonder what all happened here. What was what was the big flash? The big flash. Why are we here? Even our night and day cycle is odd. Sometimes days last ages and nights come rarely. And those clouds, so strange. What's happened to our Earth? Oh well, enough of that boring stuff. I once had a real oh god cookie day. Cookie. Cookie day at the doctor's office. I was in the waiting room reading a teen magazine. Normally I don't indulge in adolescent publications, but I couldn't, <laughs> but I couldn't resist. I had recently heard the new artist on the radio. Use your less your utensils? She's some young woman, maybe a boy. I don't know. In the way that Shiloh can really grasp my attention. So I'm reading this magazine, I saw Newly on the cover. I still wasn't able to identify if it was a man or a woman, but as I'm reading, I notice something on the ceiling. I look up to see that there is some water damage. You'd think a doctor would make enough money to maintain his office. I guess he cares about his cool jet skis more than his patient's comfort. And his assumably, assum, assumably big house and hard-bodied wife, I wish my wife was like, oh, here we go. Light was like that. Big ol' melons. Just then, a drop of the water falls from the ceiling. My eyes trail it all the way down to the ground. I stared at the floor for some time watching the carpet absorb the water. Suddenly, my attention is caught by a small child. The child was, was glaring directly at me. I saw the devil looking right back at me beneath his eyes. I got nervous and quickly stared directly at my feet as to not aggravate the child. And that's when I noticed something. 
I was wearing two different kinds of socks! Golly, I'm all revved up after these thrilling exchanges. To be fair, you're a bit of a bore. But beggars can't be... <laughs> okay, don't call me boring, bitch. Uh, hey, first offense is a 10 minute timeout, then you'll get a permit ban. Not fucking around. I think I'll stick around. I've got many a story to tell. Sweet! Nern Quan Guan joined my party. So I'm gonna assume he's gonna interrupt me throughout my my walking randomly. Or in battle. Just gonna interrupt me. Lovely. Good shit. I'm really glad I really glad I got this guy on my side. I wonder what he does actually. I see his skills from the lobby. Oh fuck it. We'll just we'll just wait to see a battle. A bar. We getting turned tonight. No! What's happening, my man? You got a couple maps for me? I'll run with your pack, brother. In rage, Ironhead, an energetic ex pro wrestler known for his devastating headbutts, El Rage always puts the battle first and his health second. He has high speed and attack, but somewhat low defense. Wait, can I get him to join my party? I don't think I have seventy max. Oh, thank God. I thought he was going to fight me. I have a little interest in scandalous magazines. I'm just looking for a stiff drink and good memories. It's all this world has to offer me. Mags are the currency. Mags are the... Oh, this lets me see. No, 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 stop! So I can probably hire this guy when I get enough mags. Bars, you can often find people for hire. Okay, yeah. You can know, posting and access your party information for when you want to swap party members and out. Bars are great places. What up, Terry? The world can be safe. Oh, yeah, we already read all those posts. This is a nice potato-shaped house. This should be exciting. Nothing. Well, bottle! Wait. This is a trap. If I do, if I press that fucking radio, this blows up. I'm calling it. Dad? You deal with it. Dad? I th was that just imagining shit probably? I th I think he went he like relapsed or whatever the fuck it's called when people uh, yeah it's real or who cares. You know what I'm saying? This is garbage. You found a leather poncho? It's not the same room. Wait, that's the other house. This is a different house. Put the poncho on, is it good? Made from rabbit murder. I don't want it. I'll sell it. Fuck it. I'll, I'll, I'll pawn it. Fake shop. Look at that guy. That's a, that's a fucking thief. Listen here, brother. I got a stack of magazines with your name on it. I just need you to get me a refreshing bottle of liquor. I do it myself, but I'm all washed up. True, like every single league streamer. Here you go, buddy.